Hey guys, how to turn Fox it? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm doing my 2017-18 Game Week 1 predictions, and here's the game that will be played. <laughs> Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe, because I think this is a pretty original video, because I d I'm not any big YouTubers like Spencer of CV who have done it. So yeah, I kind of just made it up while watching the game last night, Arsenal v Leicester, 4-3, good start to the Premier League. I can't include that game though, because it's already been played, so I already know the score. So these videos will be uploaded on either Thursday or Friday every week, hopefully. So yeah, I might miss a couple weeks, because I, it's going to be hard trying to upload 42 weeks in a row with the same video, as long as my other videos and all my other stuff I have to do. So yeah. the what for us in Liverpool game I think will be two two because Coutinho handed in a transfer request. I don't think he can play as well as he can. So do do So first it's Burnley v Chelsea and I think this will be three one Chelsea because Chelsea I support Chelsea so I'm optimistic. They won the league. I think they'll win the league again as you can see in my league prediction table and yeah I Burnley I think Burnley will get one lucky goal it'll be like an own goal or a, like lucky goal as I said when you say the same thing twice Southampton versus Swansea I think will be the boring game in the game week one I think it'll be nil nil because none of them have got good defence or good attackers so nil nil the first game of their season. The next game is Man City, I was about to say Man U, versus Brighton. I think this will be 5 0 to Man City because everyone thinks they'll win the league, pretty much except for me. But I think they'll come third, I think I said, or second. But they've spent over £200 million on their defence, so I don't think they'll concede many goals. They might buy Mbappe, who might get goals, but at the moment, I think they'll. Get quite a lot of goals with Aguero, Jesus, Bernardo Silva, and yeah, so five nils. The third game is Crystal Palace versus Huddersfield. I think this will be a close match, but two one to Crystal Palace because they're at home, and Huddersfield have just come up to the Premier League, so they will need to get used to like the style of play because in the Championship it's like slower play, like passing it around, but in the Premier League you need to go get the goals. So. I think it'll be 2-0 to Tottenham when they play Newcastle because Tottenham haven't bought anyone as I'm filming this and they're really reliant on Kane so if he gets like an injury I don't think they'll do well in the league as I said but in this game I think Kane will score one and then get subbed off early on and then like Ericsson will score a good free kick. In the Everton Stoke game I think it'll be 1-1. Because Lukaku has been sold to Man U, of course, but they've brought in Sandro, who will score all the earliest goals in pre season. So, yeah. In the Man U versus West Ham game, I think it will be 3 2 to Man U, because they've got Pogba, Lukaku, Lindelof to slowly up the defence even more. And West Ham have brought in Chikorito, Hart, and Altovic, so I think they'll do well against Man U for the first I game. I think it'll be 1-0 to West Brom when they play Bournemouth for the first game of the Premier League season because West Brom have very you know who is good for them. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and like button and roll the outro. She played the fiddle in an Irish band But she fell in love with an Englishman Kissed her on the neck and then I took her by the hands of baby I just wanna dance